Well, I wonder if you could show us a little bit uh, of the banjo picking that you first learned, maybe the first tune that you learned from your mother uh, in, the, in the style that she played. Mike, I'll try to. Uh, it was what I call the claw hammer, and the tune was, uh, was Shout Little Luli. And uh, I play it just a little bit different now than she did then, but you want me to show if I can as much as I can like she played it? Yes, first. Yeah. Okay. so far. Uh, I wonder if you could show uh, the, the other ways, Ralph. Mike, I'll do my best to, and uh, the first way that I'll do it, I'll use my thumb up on the fifth string, and then I'll use this one finger here uh, coming up on it, mm -hmm. as you'll notice. Slow that down a little bit for them and so they can see just what that finger is doing. That's a busy first. Here. Now there's a, at least a couple other tunings that you picked the banjo in and I wonder if we could Get it down into the G. We'll do her. There's a, a lick that uh, I want to get the folks <coughs> to see here. Uh, you were playing it uh, out when we were warming up here, where you, you go down on that string and then tickle. get something on the backstroke. Take it a little bit. Yeah, that's okay. right. Uh, I'll play a tune that, uh, that I made myself, Cutting the Cornbread. Good. Which one was the first uh, was the first I learned to play? But uh, since I played a little Maggie there, the uh, the one finger, I'll just play a little of it if you want me to. Great.
she's drinking wet She's hoarding I wonder if you could drop it down into that <clears throat> other tuning. Do you have a name for this tuning too? I call it the sawmill key. Okay. You know, it's a it's in a D chord. You you, you uh, lower your second. Sometimes I mess it up too. I was telling about other people. <laughs> <laughs> 